So, seeing as this is the first video of 2018, I suppose I've got to say to you, hope you've had a nice Christmas and I hope you're having a good new year. I'm really, really sorry for the lack of updates. It's just been pretty full on over Christmas and there's been a few events which has obviously meant that I couldn't do the videos I wanted to do, which I will go into. So this is just basically a little update video just to fill you in on where um, things have been. So uh, here we go. Well, what's happened? The um, the last video I did was the Billy Can one. Um, that was about November time. So the idea was I was going to be going out and doing a camp. And I didn't. I couldn't because there was a couple of things that came up. And then we came into December where I had a bit of a car accident and managed to put a nice stonking great dent in the side of the car. Uh, I'll show you that now. The slide on the ice caused... Um, that damage, as you can see on the, uh, the bottom there, and it doesn't uh, sort of close very well. Uh, the door itself locks uh, fine, opens fine, the, uh, the electric window mechanism works fine, doesn't notice any leaks, I suppose you should be grateful it hasn't done any damage to the, the floor pan. Um, let's open the, the door there. You can see it's affected. It's on the side there. Obviously, one one thing pushes into another. Same there. Well, there you have it. That was the prang. So, uh, you know, light panel damage. I think is what the insurance company say, rather than you know structural damage. And as far as I'm concerned, hopefully it's going to get all fixed. So I'll keep you posted with that one anyway. But that meant I couldn't do a video that I was going to do about the car. Um, there was it seemed a little. It, didn't seem a lot of point in doing it. Um, then, those of you who don't know, um, probably because I haven't mentioned it on YouTube, though it has been on my Instagram, um, I've had a lot of problems with my toe for the last um, eight months, something like that. And basically, springtime last year, I, I bashed it, you know, gave it a good old dunk, and ever since then, it's never been right. Uh, there's been problems with the nail, there's been problems with the skin near the nail. Um, it sort of culminated uh, around December time with another trip to the doctors has referred me to the uh, uh, podiatrist and uh, they took one look at it and told me I had to have a surgery on it which was basically what's called a partial nail evolution. They cut basically down the side of the, uh, the nail, take out the, the bits and then they put a thing called phenol in which is a chemical that basically stops the nail from growing back. Um, dress it up, um, that was on Tuesday and I went back Thursday to have the dressing changed and have a, like a dressing pack so hopefully they say that between sort of anywhere between six and ten weeks, five ten weeks it should be pretty much sorted, I'm hoping because it's been a real barrier um, for me, I've sort of I, I can do the walks and I can do the uh, sort of the, the going out and enjoying you know the great outdoors as I call it but it's always a bit of a, a pain literally because um, any sort of walking if you knocked it it was causing me problems and causing me pain and also there's the uh, trying to keep it clean in the field it's, it, it needed sorting so the good thing is from a pain point of view it's actually less painful than before I had it operated on so happy days I think is the word I'll say um, where are things going to be for this year? Well, my aim was, again, on another video, um, which didn't get done, was um, you know, looking at 2018 or something like that, what was going to happen. Well, we're in 2018, and the first um, bit which I was going to say was that my aim was to do uh, um, a camp, an overnight camp, once a month. So, you know, obviously January through to December. Maybe different woods, maybe the same wood, I hadn't really decided, but uh, um, obviously with only a few days until the end of the month and no chance of doing an overnight camp, that's January's gone. So, a bit, bit annoyed with that because that's that, I, I thought I was going to sort of be able to do that, but um, oh, well, that's one of them, isn't it? You, it'll be unique because it can be, um, I, I'll do 12, 12 overnighters in uh, um, 11 months. Not just uh, solo camps, maybe some family camping as well. We've already got that booked down. Um, we're going to take the family. Loved it when we went over to uh, um, that pitch up 
camping, sorry, Pitch Perfect camping. Um, events wise this year, um, I decided that I would go to the Bushcraft show again. I'm just going to go down for one of the days and I'm going to tie that in with getting the, some camping somewhere, possibly, you know, not too far away from there. So I might see you there if you if you knock it around there. Um, I'm not going to the Wilderness Gathering this year because I went last year, so I'm not going to go this year. Uh, I'll probably go 2019 if they're still doing it. Um, I've got other things on that, uh, around that weekend, but I am going to the prepper meet. And um, as soon as I knew about it, um, I think I found out about it um, via Instagram because sometimes things get broadcast on there quicker than YouTube. Um, yeah, actually booked it down. Um, jobs are good, and so I'll be there. Um, and it should be a really, really good uh, show. So that's um, the nuts and bolts of uh, the year as I look at it. Um, so, you know, sorry the videos weren't done. And, you know, I'm sure you can appreciate with everything that's gone on, uh, you know, some things have to take a bit of a backseat. Um, again, any comments or suggestions, feel free to put them at the bottom. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.